That sounds like... They have a new model soul dot? Hello, beautiful children of class seven. It looks like our time to fight has come once again. Scarlet? Scarlet, is that you? <laughs> Not a fan of you suddenly showing up. Oh well. I still owe you for managing to escape from us back at Gorelia Fortress. <laughs> I suppose so. But for what it's worth, I just don't care. I don't care about our past encounters. I don't care about the Noble Alliance, and I don't care about what happens to this country. Huh? What do you mean? I have no reason to want to cling to life. See, punish the man who stole everything from me just to put a railway through my homeland by putting a bullet in his heart. That was all I lived for. Now it's done. Right now I'm nothing but a walking corpse searching for a place to die. That's why I've come to see you, Ashen Prince. You're the perfect opponent for me to fall in battle against. She's just like V was. She's lost the will to live as well. What a spoiled child. <laughs> Still, you're all welcome to join me if you want. This Kestrel Soldat was designed for pure speed. And I'm going to be pushing it past its limits and flying it straight to hell where V and G went. But there's always room for more passengers on the trip. I'll give you the full story if you decide to join us. Sound fair? And if you choose not to join? Well, that way has its own charms, I suppose. If it's a fight you want, I can grant you that much! But I'm not going to make the same mistake twice! I won't let anyone else so easily choose to die! If you think you can stop me, go right ahead and try, Ashen Awakener! This will be a tough one. Be careful!
did it. Nice work, Reed. <laughs> I can see why you were seized last night. You fought just as wonderfully as he does in his Azure Mountain. Now I can go with no regrets. This is bad. Watch out, Marine! Pushing her sold off for that kind of speed put a huge strain on its orbital engine. At this rate, the same thing that happened with B's gonna happen here, too. I won't let that happen. I'm not going to stand back and allow anyone else to die. Not if I have the power to stop it. We're doing this, Valimar! Acknowledged. There really is no end to your recklessness. Is that our Soldat's cockpit? Yeah, looks like I managed to separate it in time. I want to check to see if she's all right in there just in case, though. <laughs> you put on a good show, Reen. All right, everyone. We're going in. We'll check if everything is clear inside. Follow when you can. I will. Take care, everyone. Our objective is to infiltrate the fortress and apprehend my father, Duke Alborea. Remain on guard at all times. Let's hurry. Class 7, Group A, advance into the fortress! How is she, Valimar? I detect vital readings from inside. Her life appears to be in no danger. <sighs> this should do it. Uh. Are you okay? Why did you have to? I was so close. So close to being reunited with them. Sorry, but I wasn't about to let that happen. I can't pretend to know everything about the life that you've led. But based on what I do know, I don't believe it's okay for that life to come to an end like this. Accept justice for what you've done, and then find a way to atone for your crimes. Hmm. You really are soft. Uh, uh. Looks like she passed out. Still, I'm glad I made it in time. Same here. <laughs> That's... It's Ordeen! How long have you been there? Oh, how cute! Did you come because you were all worried about your friend? <laughs> you got me. Still, I wasn't expecting you to try a bet with stakes quite that high. Did you even stop to think for one second about what would happen if you got caught in that explosion? I wasn't thinking at all, to be honest. Still, if I can't win a bet like that, what chance do I have of winning against you? Right, Crow? <laughs> Fair enough. Well, thanks. Oh, and reinforcing your weapon with Zemirian ores not a bad idea. Just know that you're gonna need to do more than reinforce some old sword to match up to Ordeen. <laughs> So, you know, keep working your way through those trials. Oh, and that was some fine work you did in making it, George. Can't wait to see what the final product looks like. I think you'll like what you see. As for the two of you, Toa and Angelica, looks like you've really gotten the hang of flying that thing. I don't think there are many students out there who can learn to handle a cutting-edge cruiser in a couple of weeks. <laughs> you two are nuts. Huh. It was nothing. We can't afford to take forever getting used to a ship when we've got a troublemaker like you to bring home. Just you wait. You'll be coming back to us. I promise you that. And I hope you're ready to be on cleaning duty until graduation as a penalty for worrying us so much. <laughs> if you think you can do it, go right ahead. 
You still got a long way to go before you can defeat me. But I ain't gonna complain if you actually pull it off. <laughs> okay, time to get back to work. Your classmates must be waiting inside for you by now. You should go after them. We'll get Valmar back on board the Courageous and keep watch here. You can count on that. 